Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Minecraft with me, DX Phoenix. and today we're going to be getting a automated mana generation going on because I have mana leading to over there, it's actually running underground at the moment but it's keeping that filled so that's nice so it stops the pesky enderman from getting away and as you can see the lovely little um, beacons going off in the background over there but let's make sure that we've got a constant mana generation going because at the moment we don't so even though we've got mana which can get over to there there is no mana being produced and i have just i've decided on a plant or a flower that will do just a thing for us so let's get into it okay then ladies and gentlemen so i've just been gathering some bits quickly so i'm just going to drop you there you in there and you, you can stay there for now, because I'll be needing you in a bit. I'm just needing four of these. And I'm just going to try and quickly craft up those. Fantastic. Actually, can you switch to there? Switch them around just a bit faster. And now, please, you work. Look. Right there. Ugh, typical. The moment I come back. I knew it. I knew it. Thank you. Right, four thermal edits, but this isn't where we stop this yet. Now, I need those. I need one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four those you can probably see where i'm going with this now and that's how i make you i don't make glistening ones i've forgotten how to make this glimmering it's two okay so i need another four that's not too bad two three four go there you go there and you go there fantastic there's four of you one of you there, just give it in there. It's you and you. Fantastic. Now then, here comes the next stage. I'm actually going to move you forward a little bit. There, a bit actually. I'm going to put you there. I'm just going to one, two, three, four. You, where's the diviner? Fantastic. Now, thermal lilies. Thermal lilies go there. I don't want this coming out of there. So, what I'm going to do, I don't even know why I'm running over here. Oh, chemical bag. I should have. Oh, I don't. Don't have my chisels and bit bag. Hmm. Back in a moment, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just going to hunt that down and hopefully find it. So, two moments. All right, then, ladies and gentlemen. So, I'm back. I've put down some small little sandstone, sand, sandstone, sandstone um, chiseled bits down around like this. I've done like two to one of these um, purely to keep the lava contained. Uh, next thing I need is you. In fact, I want you here because I want to show you. I am at 1 million life essence or LP. Life points. As soon as I do that, boom. But. Doesn't seem to be going down. That is filling up. So for anything that comes into contact with that lava. I'm just going to bolt it down to here. Check this. Right, my life points are still going up. I seem to be in some vicinity in order for that to trigger to see it. I'm 
interesting sound. What is that? That is going to die. I got some little very pollen. That's not having to use, that's fine. That noise is quite annoying though. Let's try and find out what is causing that and I'll be back in just a moment. Right then, so I appear to have run into the problem. Um, my life essence has just been depleted from one million. So that's the interesting thing, but we know it works. We fly back. We know it works. We know it powers this thing entirely up. Um, that's going to be an interesting thing to fix. So we know lava works on the thermal loaders. Thermal loaders are very quick bursts. I think we need a way of turning this ritual off. I think it is possible. I think it is redstone related. You can turn them off. I think. It's been a while. Especially this new version of the magic, I'm not entirely sure. But we do know it power it can fill up quite a bit of mana. Right, next right, so thermal it is. There is another thing we could do which could make TNT. No, thermal is I think is gonna be the way to go. Other than that, it would have been hydroandrias. They require a lot of um maintenance. And apparently so does this. I can't read that from over here for some reason. Does that not stay chunk loaded? What's happening? How bizarre. Don't even think about it. Can I go? Is that it? My brain has just clicked. Shouldn't be. This should be loaded. It is loaded. It's not. It's not chunk loaded. That's why, because it is not junk loaded. Okay. Claim all around here as well. That's why I also couldn't keep an eye on my life essence. Now, if I go over to there. Yes, it's still happening. Uh, uh. There. So, 
and all of a sudden stopped. Is it a junk loading? Who knows? That is an interesting little thing. Excuse me. Right, so. Not sure how to fix that little issue. It might be distance now. The mobs might just be despawning, even though it's chunk loaded. Other than that, I need to use a mob spawner in there. Ooh, that's going to be messy. Oh. Yeah, because it's stopped again. Mobs are despawning. Hmm. I could fix that. I could fix that. That's not a problem. I just need to be able to keep them alive. I just need to keep them around, which means I need to stay around that area for a period. Do I? Who knows? All right, we have this. It works. I just get very nauseous when doing it. Not that big of a deal. But in the meantime... Um, I'm going to end it here. Thank you all for watching. However, I do need to admit to something. That Minecraft is going to be going away um, for a bit. I've got some ideas for some things to take its place. Um, sadly, I've gotten to the end point of what I can... of my comfortability with what I can do in this version of Direwolf 20's mod pack. There is plenty more for you guys to do. Go check it out. If by popular demand people say they want to see me do more stuff with this mod pack, I will try my best to show some, do some showcases off of some things that I've been able to do with it. Other than that, when Minecraft comes back, we'll be doing a different mod pack and it will be a different um, Minecraft version. I was thinking 1.7. We're going to be going back a bit. If people want a um, more recent one, let me know in the comments below. Um, also, let me know on Twitter at DXPhoenix66613. Also, if you're worried about missing any content of mine at all, hit that subscribe button. That bell, note, that bell icon as well there lets you know whenever a video goes up. And also... There's more stuff you want to watch. I stream on a Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Eve evenings in the UK is from 8 o'clock on a Friday till about 10. I do a two-hour stream and a three-hour stream on the Saturday and Sunday. Catch me there, DX Phoenix 66613 again, and I'll see you guys there. And take care and get ready for some more content coming up. Take care, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.